Hi there, Simon from simonwoods.com. Uh, today's wine, Marcus de Casa Concha, uh, 2012 Carmen Air, uh, from Pumo in Chile. And this is one of the labels uh, from Conchi Taro, uh, Chile's uh, largest uh, wine company. And um, in this case, well, a lot of the time with Conchi Taro, big uh, is usually reasonably beautiful. Let's see whether that's the case here. Well, I stick my nose in there and it's got um, lots of young br brush, I was going to say brush, young, bold, fruity promise. Um, and so there's these uh, really dark, dense damsons, uh, black currants, blackberries, that really dark fruit spectrum. But then there's other things going on there, a bit of spice. Um, not so much of uh, what I think of as the green bean edge of Carmen Air. Uh, but it's got this uh, exotic edge still in there, uh, so the oriental spices, uh, maybe a little bit of chocolate too. When you taste it, some of that earthy green bean edge, does, um, coffee, green coffee bean more than uh, green out and out green bean, that edge comes through. And there's this uh, rounded, uh, juicy, rich core of flavour. Um, there's a slightly dry edge to the finish. Uh, I don't know whether that's uh, that will uh, as it as it warms up. I've, I've pulled it out of a reasonably cool cellar, um, and w whether as the wine warms up, whether that ed and also as it opens up to the air, uh, whether that will dissipate. But I think the fruit there is sufficient to uh, uh, to overcome it. So if you're going to have some now, uh, and it's pretty tasty wine, so I would uh, I would uh, probably go and uh, go and get some. Uh, give it a chance. Give it, shove it in a jug for an hour before before you uh, before you drink it, just to to let some of those flavours develop more fully. Uh, it feels like a wine that's good when you first open it, but will be all the better for an hour and a half, two hours uh, after. Uh, yeah, after a little bit of air gets to it. So um, good and uh, will be even better. See you soon.